Hey, it's Ben and Drew, the food dudes. It's Ben and Drew, the food dudes. <laughs> ben and Drew. That looks like a weapon. We're here at the 2012 LA County Fair. Today we're at Golden Road Brewery here in Atwater Village. A hot tip for Mojo, guys. Just the meat, not the skin of the grape. It's what you want to do. <laughs> On today's show, we Movember it up and shave these damn beards. Ow. Accuracy is important. Let's do like 50% hurt Ben, 50% <laughs> really fast. <laughs> Come on, you're already full. We have two more places to go. <laughs> hey, it's Ben and Drew, and we are counting down the top 10 hot dogs in Los Angeles. We've been eating hot dogs for months. <laughs> All these places, just to find you the best dogs in town. And I think we finally did it. We're here at our number one hot dog joint in Los Angeles, Vicious Dogs in North Hollywood. <laughs> so what's good? Oh, we got a brand new Reese's Peanut Butter Dog. Oh my God. We love this guy. I want to be something unique here. I want to make something that nobody else makes. Really? You did it. Thank you. This is our favorite hot dog place. My yeah, brother! This is hey, dog number one. Number one in LA. So right. Hallelujah. <laughs> We're gonna try totally fried PB and J. This thing is a stomach bomb. I think it's really tasty, but it Jeff, might end your day. Eat it at 4 p.m. Yeah. It's deep fried tricks right here. I think it's pretty good. I think it's even, interesting. You know, yeah. It's it's Eat. not. Deep fried lobster on a stick. It's too salty. But that's just the breading. It's good. It's not overcooked, which is amazing. Is it worth $14? No. This is not worth $14. It's Ben and Drew with today's 30 second mandate. Today we're drinking Dogfish Head Chicory Stout, and this is like coffee mixed with beer. If you like the stout, yeah, you definitely want to check this out. And it's dogfish, and, and they don't miss the mark often, so we say drink, drink it. it. Races. Some of them winners, some of them bacon. For first in the red section, we have Gillaham. Here for Gillaham in the red section. And for the green section, we have the Pork Fessor. So, green section, get excited for the Pork Fessor. At the end of the race, everybody gets a coupon for a free pound of bacon. Los Angeles may be the land of eternal summer, but autumn is just a short drive away. In Oak Glen, home of autumn. With so many varieties of apples and apple-based products, the only question is, what would you do with your apple? Guy came and dropped off keys to a new silver Acura ILX and then he disappeared. Brian and I headed up to Randy's Donuts in Inglewood, the one with the huge donut on top. They make a pretty solid apple fritter. Then Lisa and I played kickball in Venice. Everybody was in costume and we had to skip to the bases in the odd innings. Afterwards, we drove through Sunny Grill in Mar Vista, where the marine layer made it look like an 80s music video. After a long day of grease bombs, we headed back to my place for a Halloween shindig. I was Walter Sobchak, Ben and Lisa were Fen and Flame Princess, Brian was an undecided voter, total cop out. Whatever, my shit was poignant and topical, yo. What do we put in your mouth is the game where we choose a food, feed it to our guests, and have them guess yes or no questions to see if they can figure out what we put in their mouth. Time begins now. Alright. Uh, oh, close, close, close. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Oh, damn. <laughs> right. Is it some sort of corn dog? It is! Right. Related, yes. Is, is it like a weird batter? Like Maybe. It yes. could be. Maybe. Could be, yeah. Well, Michelle, final answer. What have you just eaten? I think it's like a cookie batter or cake batter corn dog. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, we should just shut it down. Just shut the whole thing down.